Now we're going to take a look at a triangle. A uh, triangle is one of the most common submissions and it comes out of everywhere. Had a training partner in Brazil that really liked to triangle me uh, and he invented a lot of crazy setups and today I'm going to show you one of his great setups uh, so it can be really sneaky, you'll catch people with it a couple times and then they're going to stop turning into you and let you keep their back. Let's check it out. All right. I've done some things right. I got here on Mike's back. Remember that space between the pelvis and the lower back that we've talked about in uh, previous videos, a giant killer, that gives me the ability to pull him down and control him. Mike's a tall guy, okay? So I am going to come over. I like my seatbelt grip, but from here, we're gonna move to the two-on-one position. The two-on-one is very good for controlling and can make it very difficult for Mike to get back into the game. It also takes his hands away from his neck and he's gonna be constantly thinking about this. So while his hands are up here doing this, okay, I am going to take my hand out and I'm gonna feed it underneath my knee. When I feed it underneath my knee, I'm gonna get control of that wrist. This will be the hardest part of the move, but you're gonna find that it's actually not as hard to do once you get a little bit of practice at it. So from here, I know that Mike can't turn this way. If he tries to turn, his own arm catches him. So what that's done is it's limited the way that he can turn. When he turns, he's gonna turn straight into the triangle. All right, so when I'm here, we're gonna turn just a little bit so you can see a little bit of an angle, stop. Again, remember you're underneath your own leg controlling. When he starts to turn nice and slow, you're gonna find that the arm comes in. You'll see it in a different angle in a second, again. So <clears throat> I'm controlling, two on one. Remember, I'm gonna go underneath my own knee and I'm gonna control. Now, I control when he turns by taking out that second two on one hand. I'm gonna take it out and look at when he turns, it threads his hand underneath. When it threads his hand underneath, it's gonna be very easy to hit that triangle. Two on one, feeding underneath the leg. Very slowly, he turns in, right in there. Look at, nice and tight and controlled. So I seat belt, I pull him in, I two on one, underneath my own leg, very slowly I allow him to turn in, right there ladies and gentlemen, triangle. And you can see, he does it to himself. The trick, and just so that we're all on the same page, chest this way please, just so that we're on the same page, is two on one, feeding and controlling that hand underneath. If you control it underneath, you can even be proactive and go get it, okay? It's a great position. The hardest part is gonna be feeding that hand underneath your leg. In the gi, I find that there's a lot of friction. No gi, that move is the jam.